Big Nose Kate, the untold story of a Wild West legend. In the annals of the American Wild West, amidst tales of gunslingers and outlaws, there exists the remarkable saga of a woman whose life was as tumultuous and vibrant as the era itself. This is the story of Mary Catherine Horany, better known by her moniker, Big Nose Kate. Though often overshadowed by her association with the infamous Doc Holliday, Kate's journey from a Hungarian immigrant to a legendary figure of the frontier is a testament to the resilience and fortitude of women in the Wild West. Join us as we unravel the life of Big Nose Kate, exploring her adventures, her struggles, and her indomitable spirit. The Early Years Born in Hungary in 1850, Mary Catherine Horany's early life was marked by tragedy and upheaval. Her family emigrated to the United States in search of a better life. They sought refuge from the political strife that ravaged their homeland. The Horonies, dreaming of freedom and opportunity, embarked on a perilous journey to America, arriving with hopes that were as vast as the land itself. Settling in Iowa. However, the death of both parents left Kate and her siblings in the care of foster homes. Yet, the reality they faced was harsh, the language was unfamiliar, the customs strange, and the struggle to establish a new life was daunting. This early adversity forged in Kate a resilience that would define her life. Journey to the West As a young woman, Kate's thirst for adventure led her to the bustling cities and streets of St. Louis and the lawless avenues of Dodge City where Kate found herself amidst gamblers, gunslingers, and dreamers. These towns, alive with the promise and peril of the frontier, served as the backdrop for Kate's formative years. Dodge City, known as the Queen of the Cowtowns, offered Kate her first taste of the Wild West's unfettered freedom and danger. It was here that she learned to navigate the complexities of frontier society, honing her skills in gambling and her ability to stand her ground in a world dominated by men. Meeting Doc Holliday Kate's life took a fateful turn when she crossed paths with John Henry Doc Holliday, a dentist turned gambler and gunslinger. The relationship between Kate and Doc Holliday was as volatile as it was passionate. Their love was a tempest, marked by fierce arguments and tender reconciliations. Yet, through it all, their loyalty to each other was unwavering. Kate's devotion to Doc during his battles with tuberculosis was a testament to their bond. She was his nurse, confidant, and fiercest protector, standing by him when many had turned their backs. Their shared adventures and misadventures, from the gambling halls of Dodge City to the tense streets of Tombstone, painted a portrait of a partnership that defied the conventions of their time. Their tumultuous relationship was marked by passionate love and fierce quarrels. Their bond was complex, forged in the fires of their shared struggles and mutual respect. The OK Corral and Aftermath Kate's involvement in the events leading up to the infamous gunfight at the OK Corral is a subject of much speculation. The gunfight at the OK Corral was not merely a moment of conflict but a culmination of the escalating tensions within Tombstone. The town, split between lawmen and outlaws, with the Earps and Doc Holliday on one side and the Cowboys on the other, was a powder keg waiting to explode. Kate's involvement in these events, though shrouded in mystery, suggests she was more than just a bystander. Rumors suggest she played a crucial role behind the scenes, her loyalty to Doc and the Earps positioning her in the intricate web of alliances and enmities that defined Tombstone's history. After Doc's death in 1887, Kate's journey did not end but took on new directions. She traversed the West, from New Mexico to Colorado, adapting to the changing times. Her roles were as varied as the landscape she crossed, from managing boarding houses to, according to some accounts, running a brothel. These years were marked by resilience in the face of solitude and societal change. Kate's ability to reinvent herself, to rise again and again from the ashes of her past, showcases the indomitable spirit of a woman who refused to be defined by tragedy or time. Legacy and Final Years, The Cultural Impact of Big Nose Kate The legacy of Big Nose Kate in literature and film oscillates between myth and reality, often amplifying her association with Doc Holliday while obscuring the nuances of her own life. In popular culture, she is sometimes reduced to a caricature of the Wild West woman, 
yet her true story is far more complex. Recent scholarship and interest in the women of the Wild West have begun to paint a fuller picture of Kate's life, recognizing her not just as a footnote in the tales of men like Holiday but as a formidable figure in her own right. We're reminded of the countless untold stories of women who faced the Wild West with courage and tenacity. What aspects of Kate's life do you find most fascinating? A woman of many faces. Beyond the infamous moniker and the tales of gunfights and gambling halls, Kate was a woman of profound complexity and contradiction. Her life was a dance of survival, played out on the stages of some of the most lawless towns in the American West. Yet, amidst the chaos, she forged a path that was uniquely hers, navigating the challenges of her time with wit, courage, and an indomitable spirit. Her relationships with other women, her adaptability, and her fierce independence offer us a glimpse into the multifaceted nature of women who refuse to be defined by the constraints of their era. The Fabric of Frontier Society The world Kate inhabited was a melting pot of cultures, ambitions, and dreams. The silver mines of Tombstone, the bustling streets of Dodge City, and the gambling dens of Deadwood were not just backdrops to her life but active participants in the shaping of her legend. These frontier towns were places of opportunity and danger, where the social order was constantly being negotiated and where women like Kate played significant roles in defining the cultural and economic landscape. Their contributions, often overlooked in the grand narratives of the West, were instrumental in the development of these burgeoning communities. Legends and Myths The myth-making machine of the Wild West has, over time, blurred the lines between fact and fiction. Kate's life, intertwined with that of Doc Holliday and the Earp brothers, has been romanticized, vilified, and, at times, misunderstood. Yet, the legends that surround her speak to our collective fascination with a time when the rules of society were rewritten in the dust of the frontier. They challenge us to look beyond the myths to the real stories of courage, love, and survival that defined the lives of so many women like Kate. The Psychology of Survival Surviving the Wild West required more than just physical strength, it demanded a psychological resilience that was nothing short of extraordinary. Kate, with her quick wit and her ability to navigate the complexities of her world, exemplifies the mental and emotional fortitude needed to thrive in such a harsh environment. Her story invites us to consider the inner resources required to face the uncertainties and dangers of frontier life, offering lessons in resilience that resonate well beyond the boundaries of her time. Kate's Lasting Legacy In the twilight of her years, Big Nose Kate's later years were spent in relative obscurity. Big Nose Kate, Mary Catherine Horany Cummings, passed away on November 2, 1940 at the age of 90 in the Arizona Pioneers' home in Prescott, Arizona, a facility for indigent pioneers and miners. The cause of her death, as noted in historical records, was attributed to acute myocarditis, which is an inflammation of the heart muscle. This condition can lead to various complications, including heart failure, which is a plausible cause of death for someone of her advanced age at the time. Kate was buried in the Arizona Pioneer's Home Cemetery in Prescott. Her grave is marked, and over the years, it has become a site of interest for those who study and are fascinated by the history of the American Wild West. Her final resting place serves as a reminder of her storied life and her place in the lore of the frontier era. The cemetery itself is home to many pioneers and figures who contributed to the early development of Arizona, making it a historical site of significant interest. Big Nose Kate's story is a powerful reminder of the complexities and contradictions of the American frontier. It's a tale of survival, of love, and of the indomitable spirit of a woman who refused to be defined by the constraints of her time. As we close this chapter on Kate's life, we're left with a richer understanding of the Wild West and the remarkable individuals who lived it. In the end, Big Nose Kate's legacy is not just in her association with Doc Holliday or the gunfight at the OK Corral. It's in her resilience, her independence, and her unwavering spirit. Her story is a testament to the strength of women who carved their paths in history, often in the face of insurmountable odds. The legacy of Big Nose Kate is a testament to the indelible impact of women on the history of the American West. Her life story, marked by moments of triumph and tragedy, encourages us to explore the untold narratives of women who shaped the frontier. In recounting her adventures, her struggles, and her unyielding spirit, 
we are reminded of the importance of bringing these stories to light, not only to honor their contributions, but to understand the complexities of our collective past. As we reflect on the countless untold stories of women who, like Kate, face the Wild West with courage and tenacity, we are compelled to ask, what aspects of Kate's life do you find most fascinating? How do her experiences challenge our perceptions of the Wild West and the roles of women within it? Share your thoughts, your questions, and your reflections in the comments below what you thought of this video. We hope that you have been captivated by the tale of Big Nose Kate and the untold stories of the Wild West. If you think this video had value, please like, subscribe, and ring the bell icon to join us on more adventures through history. Until next time, keep seeking out the stories that move you, challenge you, and inspire you. Safe travels on your journey through the annals of the past.